Hey, what's up people and welcome back to Ask NK. Today we have news and it's quite an interesting one. Not long ago we talked about Blender 2.8, the release candidate, and you know we showed off a couple of things that is coming out for Blender and if you haven't checked that video out, link is going to be in the description so you can check it. And we've also been talking about Epic and not long ago I also made another video where I said like every single week, if you've been following the updates, every single week Epic Games just seems to come out with something incredibly nice. It doesn't matter if you're using epic games or if you're using unity it's just there that epic just doesn't fail to deliver every single week and today we have amazing news that is coming out from the guys at epic games so epic games has just awarded blender foundation that oversees blender's development a cash grant of 1.2 million dollars and this grant is something that the guys at epic games has already talked about not long ago where they said that the epic games would be committed to giving about 100 million to support game developers enterprise professionals media entertainment creators students educators and so on and so forth and for so long we have seen a couple of updates of people supporting blender i've also covered a couple of videos of other supports that has also come to blender but now i think by so much that this particular money that is being given by epic games to the blender foundation is like the highest donation the blender has ever had the money itself which has been awarded from epic games new epic mega grant program will be used to fund the blender development initiative It's actually called the professionalizing blender development initiative and i think this is one of those ideas or this is one of those uh, initiative that has actually shaped out the entire way the blender 2.8 is looking like right now but before this grant was announced something that a lot of people don't know was that the crowd sourced blender development fund which is the amount people get to donate was about let's say 37 to 38 000 euro every month which simply means that the mega grant that the guys at epic games is issuing out to blender is already doubling the amount so far so things like game developers media and entertainment enterprise education tools and open source development and i think within this area is where blender is actually falling in place there's a couple of people asking questions saying is blender going to be bought by epic games now that these guys have been giving them this set of amount or is this actually epic games new way of getting into blender and i will actually say no i'm saying no because first and foremost blender is definitely not going to be sold it is going to be open source for as long as it is unreal on the other hand has a huge heart when it comes to actually supporting tools and projects and all that stuff i mean if you've checked out the news which we've been covering for some weeks now you understand that when unreal actually buys a product or when they get to own a product they automatically make it for free so things like the joe and shave haircut thingy is for free and also twin motion has also been for free and so many other things that are there you guys can also testify to the fact that even if unreal gets to adopt blender as a tool that will be either side by side or underneath them for sure it is definitely not going to be a profit making venture as far as i know i don't think that this is going to be and to be honest this is not like the first time that the guys at epic games had shown blender some love epic games was once the main sponsor of the blender development at the point in 2014 when they actually donated about 10,000 euro to blender just for them to be able to improve the blender's fbx support capability and according to the blender chairman at that point he says that we're trying to get a solid platform for exporting from blender to unreal engine 4. so far things are going very well and you know they were hoping to create things in the future but now looking at what blender is looking like right now i think this grant actually came at the right time does it mean it should have come earlier i don't know i mean you guys can tell me about this in the comment section and so just in case you want to confirm if this is actually true you could see this in the blender official page on twitter where ton rosendell actually tweeted out and say that the mega grant is a true grant with as only requirement that they will actually you know go ahead and spend this particular amount into the development now other things that you need to know about this is this particular grant is going to span 
over three years all right so it doesn't mean that this money just stays and you know they can blow it off in, in a single year but these particular grants will be delivered over three years so they're going to deliver this amount i guess instrumentally i don't know what the sharing ratio looks like but definitely it's not something that will be handed over to them at once continuing with this statement the ceo of epic games tim sweeney actually said that open tools, library, and platform are critical to the future of digital content creators. And Blender is an enduring resource with the artistic community. And we, which is actually Epic Games, are aimed at ensuring its advancement to the benefit of all creators. So let the fight begin, all right? So the guys that actually say Blender is gonna die off soon, and the ones that are saying that, you know, things are not going to walk into shape, industry standard or not, Blender seems to be here to stay. And it's really cool to actually say this right now. You could either jump onto the bus right now, which is actually the Blender train or the Blender bus, or you could be left behind because things are happening really, really fast. I have a couple of videos coming up next, which would cover a couple of things for the blender 2.8 candidate release and probably the final release so you should keep your eye peeled and your heart open for that and that's about it guys i would like to know what you guys think about this in the comment section which of these grants do you think is the best how excited are you about this grant that has been given by epic games to blender foundation are you a blender user are you planning to get into blender what's your communication with epic games and what do you think about this tell me more about these things in the comment section and if you like this video you know what to do go ahead and hit the like button and turn on notification and if you're new here it's gonna be amazing if you can hit the subscribe button and also turn on notifications so you don't miss the next update the next video the next tutorial and until i see you guys again with the tutorial update free friday tutorial tuesday tips and tricks things like this peace